Hello again, it's Sam with Blind Shell. Today we're going to take a look at the Color Indicator app on the Blind Shell Classic mobile phone. Your Blind Shell Classic mobile phone comes with a few vision aid features built in automatically, and one of those is a color identifier. So let's go see how it works. We're going to navigate over until we hear more applications. I'm just pressing left or right on the directional pad. Messages, two of nine. Contacts, three of more applications, four of nine. There we go. I'm going to click OK. Tools, one of five. And now we need to find vision aids. I'm going to click to the left because that will be faster navigating through this menu. Vision aids, five of five. There it is. I'm going to click OK. Color indicator, one of four. And color indicator is the first item in this menu here. There are several others in here. I definitely recommend coming in here and testing them out, playing around with them. I think you'll find them very helpful. But we're going to do color indicator here today. So I'm going to click OK. Ready. Now, it said ready, and it opened up the camera here. So I have a large book here full of colors, colored pages. We're going to see if it will identify them. The way it works is you click OK and it will use the camera to identify the color. So I'm going to click OK. Brown. Brown, it got it. Here we have a blue. Let's see if it'll get the blue. Blue. Blue, it got it. So here's a gray color. Let's see if it'll get this one. Gray. Gray, yeah, it got it. Here's a green color. Green. Green. All right, I got that one. And that is basically it. It's a very simple application. You just click the button and it tells you the color. Now, I will say that this color identifier, as well as any digital identi color identifier, it needs to have good lighting. If you are in your closet, for example, and you've got just a single overhead light and the lighting is really poor, it's not going to get accurate results. You have to remember that it's using your camera. And so if the camera sees a very dark image, it's not going to give you the right color reading. So if you're not getting accurate scans, then I would recommend taking it into a more well-lit area, if possible, taking it to, over by a window or maybe outside to get the best results. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you would like to learn more about what your Blind Shell Classic can do, be sure to head over to our YouTube channel and check out some of our other videos.